Hello, people. I'm Jabby Quay. Joining me is a Char Kirk. Hi. We are going to look at Coco, the official U.S. teaser trailer from Disney Pixar. I am excited. I like Disney animation and Pixar films quite a bit. I like what Pixar has been doing lately. Yes. Um, they have been coming back up and, and improving, going back to what they know, which is telling great stories. Yes. I didn't even know this was coming out. Oh, Mexican story. VHS. I had a VCR just like that back I in the day. I have to sing. I have to play. The music, it's, it's not just in me. It is me. <laughs> when life gets me down, I play my guitar. The rest of the world may follow the rules, but I must follow my heart. You know that feeling? Like there's a song in the air and it's playing just for you. A feeling so close, you will reach out and touch it. I never knew I could want something so much, but it's true. Never underestimate the power of music. No one was going to hand me my future. It was up to me to reach for my dream, grab it tight, and make, make it, it come true. true. All right, who's in there? I'm sorry. No, what's going on? I'm just dreaming. Ah! Oh, damn it, Dad. He entered the other world, that's all. Stay with me, boy. We don't know where we are. This is a dream then. You're all really out there. Wow, that was wow. pretty cool. Do you know about Day of the Dead? Yes, uh, somewhat. It's an interesting festival. It's just, it's kind of like Mexican Halloween in a way, but everyone dresses up. I don't know that much about it, just if anyone. It's around Mexi the same time if, as Halloween. Yeah, but I'm just saying, if anyone Mexican is watching this, forgive me if my facts are completely off. But from my recollection and, and viewing of it, it seemed like Mex Mexican Halloween where they dress up with the skull faces and stuff like that, but it's nothing like gothic. It's just kind of a celebration in a way. If you go with the mythology of Halloween, All Hallows' Eve is when the veil between the living and the dead is the thinnest. The Day of the Dead, I think, would just kind of go on from there and you could pay respects to your family and friends and whoever that have passed on because yeah. they're closer to you at that time that of the year. That makes just as much sense. So it's one of those, this has obviously heavily inspired by that, the, the faces and whatnot, mm -hmm. and it's a borrowing from Mexican culture to create this interesting tale of this kid who's transporting into this alternate dimension where the dead aren't dead but they're alive they they live on and he's gonna find his dad or whoever this person is that has inspired yeah. him it sounds like an interesting adventure in itself and it's magical you yeah. know the the guitar took him into this other realm it's giving me flashbacks of that other animation book of life or the, the page master no, it's like about about a kid who played the guitar it was a cartoon that came out a few years ago yeah yeah Similar. Okay. <laughs> but I yeah. have a feeling that this is gonna be better. Yeah. Because it's Pixar. That last shot was pretty cool though. Just that epic shot of the... Because like you saw the human city and just to juxtapose that with the ghost city mm -hmm. or the undead, just how wild and how much more rich it looked. I'm like, wow, that's cool. <laughs> and I was getting goosebumps when he was talking about, oh, you gotta reach out and go for your dreams or whatever, I'm paraphrasing. But when he grabbed that guitar and then he strummed it and then all of the leaves went up and I was like, oh. Yeah. The goosebumps going up my arms. Let us know what your thoughts are in the comments, uh, how you felt about the trailer, how it hit you when you first saw, you know, some of those cool shots. Anyway, uh, check out Achara's channel, youtube.com slash Subscribe to this channel if you have not already. I'm Jabby Kowei, this is Achara Kirk. Peace out.